participating in a debate on 19 Ka Boss Khan, who will be the boss of 2019. Union Minister Prakash Javadekar and senior Congress leader Dig Vijaya Singh trained guns at one another over a range of issues. Javadekar claimed that the repeated success of the Bharatiya Janata Party in state after state since 2014 was an indication that the Narendra Modi government would be re-elected in 2019, responding to the question about how the fear of Narendra Modi is uniting opposition parties, Dig Vijaya Singh said, more parties are in the ruling alliance than with USTHE Congress is observing the day of betrayal today as the Modi government took oath on the same day four years ago. They have betrayed the 31% voters who elected the Modi government, Dig Vijaya Singh quoted Merli Manohar Joshi's remark to a question about the evaluation of the Modi government when the answer sheet is blank, how will I give marks, ask Merli Manohar Joshi, Arun Shori, Yashwant Sinha, Udit Raj, Savitri Bifool and Praveen Tagadi of VHP, whether they feel betrayed or not, said Singh. What is the report card of the four years of the Modi government? Follow our live updates, Herrera responding to the charge, Javadekar said, if our repeated success across the country conveys that the BJP is not being liked, then we would love not being liked. Only the opposition parties are said with the rise of the BJP, Dig Vijaya Singh retorted saying, state elections are different from parliamentary polls. Things will be different in 2019. We are fighting the BJP and RSS on the grounds of ideology and we will keep fighting them. I was in Madhya Pradesh where people told me that during the April 2nd agitation by the farmers, the police kept quiet while the workers of the BJP and RSS shot at the protesters, Dig Vijaya Singh claimed, adding, they follow the policy of divide and rule. They pit Dalits against upper caste people, Javadekar rejected the charge saying that the BJP worked for unifying the society. He launched a counterattack on the Congress saying that power brokers were ruling Delhi under the Congress government. We have put an end to it. We have brought transparency in governance, their Prime Minister Rajiv Gandhi used to say that he sent re one from Delhi and only 15 pays reached the beneficiary. Today, PM Modi sends 100 rupees and the poor beneficiary gets all of 100 rupees in his bank account. This is the work culture that we have brought in the government, Javadekar said. Feuding Dig Vijaya Singh's charge of overtaxing oil fuels, Javadekar defended the Modi government over increased mech size duties on petrol and diesel. He said that the government was sensitive and keen to find a way out to ease petrol and diesel prices. Read, we are the true architects of the united opposition, says BJP's Nin Gudkari.